In today's session, we're going to talk about how to download videos from the web, specifically YouTube, but you can actually use this tool with a couple other video sharing sites as well. So the name of this tool is vDownloader, and today we're going to go over an example of how to specifically download a five minute countdown and bring that onto your computer using vDownloader uh, all the way from installation to actually using the tool. So let's get to it. All right, so where we want to start first is head over to vdownloader.com. I, I want to actually walk you guys through how to install it because even though it's free software, they do some very sneaky things here. So I want to make sure that you don't have random stuff installed on your computer. So first we're going to download. Click that download button for vdownloader. I know it sounds super obvious right now, but trust me. Uh, you might be thankful after, right? So clicking here, the V Downloader, um, when it opens up, first you say, okay, yeah, that's fine. So you start the installation. And this next part is saying, okay, you agree to V Downloader's terms. Nothing sketchy or scary there, really. And in this next portion, you'll notice that it says in the age of too much information safe finder which is not the downloader is some other application so click decline all right uh, and so click decline right here and then next there's this thing of dragons of Atlantis do not accept that as well now you're safe <laughs> so after that's happened, it'll go ahead and download the rest of the package to be able to do the installation for you. Just want to make sure that you don't randomly end up with Dragons of Atlantis or other things like that uh, unnecessarily. All right, so now we've finished up with that and it's time to actually use vDownloader. So as you can see, once I've completed that installation, uh, it's it's popping up right now and we're gonna take it for a spin on YouTube uh, to show you how to actually pull a file now down onto your desktop so here what happens is when you've got V downloader open uh, you can actually pick uh, you know some different ways that you can save videos uh, let's say I want to save in uh, in HD Right, so I've got my videos here that I'm going to save in HD. All I have to do now is, since it is open in my computer, I'm just going to go to YouTube. Check this out. It's actually really easy. So if you go to YouTube and you look up 5 minute countdown, What's going to happen is you can see that there are all these different countdowns that you can go to. So what I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and select this first one. Sure, why not? And it's it's playing and you know it's hip. I like it. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's get this one. What you can do is select here. If you press Control C. It's going to automatically copy that into the V downloader. Check this out. Hey, look at that. It's right there. I don't have to actually type that crazy in, crazy thing in there, and now I can just click download. When I click download, it's going to go ahead and do everything else in the background here and say, okay, um, I'm going to go ahead and save this in my videos. And that's that. So now I'm going to go ahead and show you what it's like after it's done. So now it's at the point of converting. Uh, it's at 20%, 30%, and will uh, come back when it's ready to go beyond the conversion process. So uh, what you can see here is it's finishing up in the conversion process. And the great thing is there's a lot of videos on YouTube, uh, on Vimeo, that are excellent countdowns that you can use 
free out there. Uh, another suggestion I have is if you want to maybe download Minute to Win It uh, timers, uh, you know, so there's 30 second countdowns for games, which are great. Uh, in another video, we'll likely go over how to uh, mix and edit video if you want to take uh, one of these countdowns and then change the music on it. That's something pretty common and popular to do as well. So now we've finished downloading that five minute countdown video. Let's take a look at it here. So there it is. So I've now got it in my possession and it's a video file then I can move to another computer and connect to a projector and I'm off to the races. So there you have it. That was from start to finish how to use vDownloader to be able to download videos, uh, namely countdowns, for use for your classrooms and your kids' churches. Hope you enjoyed it. If you like this video, make sure to click subscribe so that you can stay in the loop for more Kidmin tips, tricks, and ideas. See you in the next video. Subscribe. 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 Subscribe.